ask Tom on home show. Alice from Alta Loma, Texas has a puddle problem. Yeah, Tom. They're forming under this house um, mm. after it rains. Go figure. Makes sense. <laughs> Alice writes, I suspect my dog dug holes and now they're causing water puddles. Is this a difficult problem to fix? She, she says, do I like use a roll of tarp and lie on it and crawl under with dirt to fill them in or do I use rake or shovel? Or is this the work for a professional, Tom? If so, what kind of well, professional? Someone who can get under that little tiny house, um, that little space <laughs> under that house. I know I can't. Uh, but yeah, you just fill it up with dirt. But the big thing is, is you got to stop the dog from digging. You go in there, they'll have fun and say, ooh, fresh place to dig. And they'll start digging again. Uh, usually when you under a house and, it, and water gets under there, which is not good, uh, you use bank sand. Yeah, that's just an inexpensive sand that you can spread up underneath there just to raise the level a little bit. Sand is like little tiny gravel, so water won't puddle on top of it. It's kind of like the beach. The water will, will sink below it very quickly. And so uh, that's, what, that's what you do, whether you drag it in with a bucket or however you want to do it. And uh, there's been cases where we've gotten people with gunite machines and big projects, and they just blew sand all up underneath the house. But the level under the house has to be higher than the surrounding areas so water doesn't crawl under the house. And you got to do something so the dog doesn't crawl under the house either. Good luck with that one. Yeah, well, it's called chicken wire. <laughs> right, run that. Out. No, sir, all kidding aside, all kidding aside, you'd run what, what, like run the chicken wire like around the house, you know, like around the edge? I mean, that house, out? you could actually do something neat with it because it's an old Texas like, uh, farmhouse. Put lattice along there or something? Yeah, yeah, or just do some trim and put the chicken wire. Two-inch poultry wire will keep a dog out as long as they don't dig underneath. So you got to put some like hardy or something down it's into the ground. Committed for the dog. <laughs> Dogs are that way. Huh? They yeah. are. Well, we got three we of love them, them but they get they get something in their head. They're going to do it. So I wonder, Tom, is this a place where maybe she wants a, a, a like a irrigation specialist or, or someone to come in here and do this? Could it be that complicated? If it's that complicated, the answer is yes. Does she need irrigation system? Yes. I don't think so. The way the question was asked. She thinks she has a dog going under there digging holes. So <laughs> digging holes, I'm gonna I'm gonna listen to the question and answer the question. But if it's a major problem where water is draining from the rest of the property under the house, absolutely. Uh, licensed irrigator uh, is is definitely someone who can get under there and, and do that, and that would be a professional. And if it's just holes under the ground, you could probably get anybody to do it. Just if a dog's digging a hole, mm -hmm. so it, you really have to assess the issue. I wouldn't yeah. call a professional because your dog dug a little hole. That no, a professional no, no. doesn't. I say a professional. Someone that does drainage systems and stuff just for a little hole. He'll right, tell you the same it, thing I did. Keep the dog from going into the house. Yeah, like you say, with the chicken wire or something like that. Okay. Yeah. You you got a question? We can help you out. Go ahead and visit homeshoreio.com. Click on that blue Ask Tom button. It'll bring you to this page, and then uh, we'll you can ask your question. You can send a picture, a video, what have you, and we'll help you out just like that. And we post a new video every day at homeshoreio.com, our Facebook page, and our YouTube channel.